Most people in America are quite familiar with aiding and abetting a person's right to do stupid things under the law. The other day I saw something unusual, but I have no way to confirm it, so I'm not about to share it, and openly I'll share it to the appropriate manager of a store. But in life I have the right to choose whether or not I'm going to share it or choose whether I'm not going to share it, but the bottom line is that when you are aiding and abetting, psychological, physical, and emotional, and intellectual, and spiritual abuse, you really are a loser in life. Because Jesus Christ is looking down at you and he is wondering what the hell you think you're doing there and openly God is displeased with you. And if you think God has said you may go out and abuse my men, you may go out and rape my women, you are foolish. At no time did Jesus Christ or God in heaven, God Lord Odin, ever say to you, this is okay with me. Please stop stealing from me. Please stop harming me. Please stop abusing me. Please stop alarming me. Please stop interfering with me. And please stop sexualizing a man's body. None of it is your right to do.